So would you like to send your PayPal money directly into Binance? I'm going to show you a few steps, a few ways of how you can do this in a very easy way. So let's get started. The very first thing I wanted to do, of course, is to have an actual Binance account. If you don't, I'm going to leave you the link down below in the description so we can all get started totally for free. Assuming that you click into this video, I assume that you already have an actual PayPal account and you already have money inside PayPal. So you should go and look into your PayPal account. You should see here into your PayPal balance that you do have available money. In this case, we don't have money anymore, but assuming that you have money here already into PayPal, I'm gonna open any tab and log into my Binance account. Once you logged it into your Binance account, it is time to choose the deposit options. Now here, what I wanna be doing here is to focus into the upper side. And here, what I can do is to choose the option that says our view. So you wanted to make sure they have an estimated balance and here, what I want to be doing here is to deposit money directly into my Binance account in order to actually send or receive money. So I'm going to choose the option that says deposit. Here, what I can do is to fund my wallet. So if you have crypto assets, choose deposit crypto. If we don't have a crypto asset, what I'm going to be doing here is to buy crypto. So what you can do is to choose from a bank deposit, a P2P trading, and buying with crypto. So usually everybody choose buying crypto. Let's say for example that I wanted to spend $15 and I received USDT. I can receive Bitcoin, Ether, USDC, and so much more. So once you are okay with that, choose the option that says pay with. So here, what I'm gonna be doing here is to add a new card. If you don't have a card, what I can tell you is to in this first step is to create or let's say access a debit online card. So you can have an actual online card in a very easy way online, for example, with first trade and so much more elements. So once you have your actual account, what you can do is to link this account directly into PayPal, use that card to add it into Binance. Now, the second solution that I can give you is to buy cryptos with pearl to pearl. So instead of going for making the buy cryptos, I'm going to try to go just a few steps back. Let's go for deposit. And instead of going with uh, buy crypto, I'm going to go for pearl to pearl trading. So here, what you can do is to trade not directly from the actual Binance, but the Binance community. So here into the Binance community, what you want to do is this, let's say for example that you wanted to buy, I choose 15 USD and my payment method should be PayPal. So choose the payment method that you have here. So choose PayPal and here what you can do here is the payment available and what you want to make sure that you have the regions of where you actually currently live in. Let's say for example, Canada. And here I do have a lot of uh, stuff. In this case, I can enable all the payments. And there we go. So you wanted to make sure that when you purchased uh, Bitcoins to an actual merchant, this one is a verified merchant. This batch means that this one has completed the verification at Binance and there has been no issue though. This one has more than 4,000 orders, 100% completion, and the price is one USD. So actually, it looks really great. Payment, perfect money. Another solution that I can give you is that if you are, let's say, currently living in the United States, you might be accessible to enter the PayPal crypto digital wallet. So the actual PayPal can manage cryptos, but in this case, crypto is not available into my country. Once again, if you are into the United States, you might be eligible to buy PayPal cryptos directly here into PayPal and use those cryptos to send it directly here into Binance. And the last solution that I can give you just in case this one actually didn't work for you, then what I can do is to go back here into PayPal and send my money away into a credit, into a debit card or into a banking account in order to use that money and to add it into Binance. And for that, I'm going to focus into pay and get paid. I go for my wallet and I choose banks and cards. Now here into banks and cards, I'm going to scroll all the way down and choose to add a bank account or a card. So here into a card, for example, I needed to add my debit or credit card number my card type, the expiration date, security code, and billing address. Once you make the verification of that account, your actual money automatically should be sent into your actual banking account if you chose the actual automatic transfers. In this case, I go for yes, 
and my money should be sent here into this banking account. Now I can use this banking account to make the deposit of cryptos using my bank account. Or lastly, what you can do is just to buy some get cost. So those gift costs, for example, here into Dribble, what you can do is to buy it directly. Let's say, for example, I can buy $15 of this this card, and my payment method, of course, should be PayPal. So you can try to focus into one of those applications. For example, there's Dribble, there's Aniva, there's so much more elements. And what you can do is to use this gift card to redeem this directly into Binance. Those are, guys, just like a few different methods of what you can do, how you can buy cryptos or using your PayPal account. So you have another payment method I can totally suggest you to do it so, but in this case that will be actually it guys. So guys, that is actually it. You have now successfully transferred money from your PayPal account into Binance, ready to start trading cryptocurrencies guys. So remember to verify the transaction details before confirming any transfer guys. With that being said, don't forget to give us a thumbs up, share it with others and subscribe to the channel if you want to see more great tools to how to get started with the crypto world. Thank you so much for watching this video guys and hopefully we can all see you next time.